Hi everybody, today we're going to be um, creating a painted essay. So here's an example of what a painted essay looks like. In the first paragraph, we have our introduction paragraph. This um, it's going to catch the reader's attention in the first sentence and give some background information. And then the next sentence is called the thesis statement or the claim sentence, your opinion sentence. And then the last two sentences are going to be your point one and point two reasons. You see that the point one is yellow, and that will be go. You'll expand on your point one in your first paragraph, and your point two is blue, and you'll expand and give some reasons and proof for in your second paragraph, and then you wrap it up in your conclusion. Let's look at an example today. So my introduction is red. I'm going to highlight that red. That's going to be a hook sentence and background information. My claim sentence or opinion sentence is going to be green. Point one will be yellow and point two will be blue. So let's read this really quick. Imagine yourself driving along a deserted stretch of wind-blown land. So this is hooking you in. You're imagining yourself driving. You come over a little rise and see a field of giant pinwheels. White steel towers topped with blades spinning madly in the wind. What you are seeing is a wind farm, a new and growing source of electrical energy. Some people think wind power is part of the solution to our need for new energy resources, but others worry that wind turbines, the towers that turn wind into energy, are ugly, noisy, and harmful to migrating birds. So this first part was just giving me background information about how to, about wind turbines and if some people agree that they're great and some people disagree. But what does this author believe? Wind is a valuable source of energy. So they're saying that wind is important. We need wind energy. So that's their opinion sentence or claim sentence. I'll highlight that green. Wind will never run out. That's their point one and it doesn't contaminate the environment. So, <clears throat> and I can see that point one, it says wind power is a renewable source of energy. So and it tells me all about how wind is not going to run out. And then blue, it says wind energy, it produces no pollution. So it, it doesn't contaminate or hurt the environment. Let's go ahead and look at another example together. This is what you all are gonna be doing today. You are going to look at the introduction, find where's the introduction, where's my claim sentence, <clears throat> where's point one and point two, and then highlight them certain colors. And I'm going to show you how to highlight today. So here's this. It says, did you know that on average, Americans spend up to seven hours a day on the computer? Computers play an important role in the lives of most of us today, whether we realize it or not. Some people, however, are beginning to ask if we really need them. Com and then the claim sentence, computers have become a necessary part of modern life. So this person believes that computers are important. And then and their reason one, computers help save storage space. And then point two is that they save time. So that is what we are working on today. To highlight, you are go up to the top, you highlight what part you want to be, and then you go to the little highlight button, highlight color up here, and choose which color you want. So you're going to use red, green, blue, and yellow today. If you have questions or need help, please hop on Zoom at 3 o'clock and I'll be available to help you.